Hey guys, Bridger Don here. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, welcome. Guys, today I'm bringing you a fragrance review from the House of Gucci. So this is from their Alchemist Garden collection. And this is going to be the last day of summer. Guys, this bottle is so gorgeous. Guys, let's just admire the bottle for a minute because this is so beautiful and it sits so pretty on my vanity. It's a pretty glass bottle and then this is the cap. It has a little bird on the top and I just really love the white and gold detail. And let me show you the box that it came in because this is really pretty. I just love the presentation of this collection. So guys, this is the box that it comes in. It's the same white and gold detail that you're getting. It's just so pretty. Guys, the whole presentation of this fragrance is just so beautiful and so luxurious. I really love the presentation. So guys, let's go ahead and get into the juice of this fragrance. Guys, let me just tell you right now, this is a woody spicy fragrance. In my opinion, this is very unique and it just smells so lovely. Guys, I recommend that you try before you buy this one because it's not gonna be everybody's cup of tea. For me, I did blind buy it, but I did want something different. I'm tired of the same old fruity floral fragrances. I wanted something unique. I want to smell different. I wanted something woody, so this was a perfect selection for me. So let me go ahead and spray this. Guys, instantly I smell cedarwood. So let me go ahead and tell you guys the notes in this fragrance. So there's cedarwood, there's cypress, there's nutmeg, patchouli, and vetiver. This is very earthy, you guys. This fragrance reminds me of a nice brisk fall morning. You're just walking through the forest, you're taking your nice morning hike, and it's a little bit breezy, so you're getting that nice scent of the pine trees around. You're just getting just the earthy smells around you, and this is what it is. This is so beautiful. It really is, it's an earthy scent, you guys. This is very earthy. So as I say that's earthy, I do smell the patchouli. The patchouli and the cedar wood mix so well in this. It kind of gives me like incense smell. And then the nutmeg is just a perfect addition to this scent because it makes it very, very spicy. Guys, this is a very unique fragrance. This is quite unisex, but to me, it leans a little bit more feminine because the nutmeg, it makes it a little bit sweet, but still a guy could wear this for sure. It's just so unique. I really don't have anything else in my collection. Like I'm looking behind the camera right now and <laughs> there's nothing like this one. I love this scent, it's so beautiful. So guys, as this develops on the skin, it gets softer. It kind of smells like cinnamon. To me, I get nutmeg and cinnamon as it starts to dry down on the skin and a little bit of woodsy notes in the background. I just really do adore the scent. Guys, this is such a perfect transition fragrance. Like right now, I believe it's probably about two days away from being fall. And this is just so perfect right now. Right now where I'm at, it's about 50 degrees in the morning and it's nice and like breezy. So this just traveling throughout the air is just so nice. Oh my gosh, you guys, the other day I did wear this outside and it was quite breezy. And this just flowing through the air was really satisfying. Like this fits the mood right now. So I definitely recommend this for fall. This is a beautiful, beautiful fall scent. I think most people would adore it. If you appreciate woody notes, you're gonna adore this one. Woody and spicy notes, you're gonna like this one. I love the presentation. Everything about it is just really nice. The sealage on this isn't super loud. It's pretty minimum. Somebody next to you is gonna smell you, of course, but it's not like super loud. This is not a beast mode fragrance in my opinion. This is pretty moderate. You're gonna get about maybe five to seven hours of wear on your skin, depending on the person. But anyways, I really do like this fragrance. I would recommend but go ahead and try it before you buy a full bottle because it might not be your cup of tea. This one is definitely gonna make you stand out. And for my guys out there that want to try this out, I recommend, I do. I think this is a really nice fragrance. It's just well balanced and it's just not your typical scent at all. Guys, this is my first overall Gucci fragrance, especially from the Private Blends collection. And I'm very satisfied with this. Like this makes me want to try out the other fragrances from the Alchemist collection because they do sound very interesting. And the bottles are just so pretty, guys. This just sits so pretty on the vanity. You have to trust me. This is one of my unique bottles. I really do adore it. And it just smells so unique. 
Oh my gosh, Gucci really did their thing with this. Guys, if you tried out any of the other Alchemist Garden fragrances from this collection, let me know which ones are your favorite because I really do love this one already, so I cannot wait to smell the others. So guys, thank you so much for watching this fragrance review. Guys, if you liked it, go ahead and give it a big thumbs up. If you loved it, that really helps me stay motivated to make more videos. And guys, thank you so much for watching. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And follow me on Instagram, my name will be right down below. So guys, you have a blessed day. Thank you so much for watching again and see you in the next video. Bye.